And welcome back to Ozarks Live. Let's head back over to Nathaniel Green Park and the Japanese Stroll Garden where Joy is taking it all in. Joy. Yeah, the Japanese Fall Festival starts like in less than two hours from now, so you got an hour and a half ish to get over here. Lisa Bankerick of Springfield Sister Cities and Friends of the Garden. All right, girl, you've got like a minute and a half. Okay. Now, sell all the people who are watching <laughs> right now on all the reasons they need to come out here starting today. Oh, we have some great stage entertainment, which you're going to see a little bit of here. We have mm -hmm. a lot of vendors. Um, the bonsai guy, Chris Cox, is here and just has an amazing display. Yeah. Uh, lots of Japanese souvenirs. Um, we have stuff for the kids. We have a kids' activity area and Springfield Regional Arts Center is giving out activity packs this year. Nice. Yeah, so just a lot of really cool things. Great food vendors, um, great shirts to purchase if you'd Love like. Us. Yeah, yeah. And this is the 25th annual. This is hugely successful. Yeah, we were going to have it last year, but COVID, you know, and so this is our 25th uh, fall festival. So 25 years of bringing a, this cultural event to Springfield. We're really proud of that. And after dark tonight uh, and, and tomorrow night. Yes, candlelight walking and and you can purchase a wishing lantern to float on one of our three ponds here. Oh my goodness. Yeah. All right. Now, you have a special guest with us now who does some origami. He's a magician also. Introduce yeah. him. Yeah. So this is Yasu Ishida, and he is a storyteller magician. Okay. And uh, he visited our festival in 2019 and back by popular demand. Yeah. He's here this year. All right. I'm going to move yeah. over a little closer, Yasu. Yeah, You're going to show us something. What are you yeah, going to show us sure. here? So this is a Japanese fan called Sensu. And Sensu has a magical power. And <laughs> <laughs> that's the kind of thing he does. Now, what are you going to be performing? Uh, I'm performing Japanese stories, and I'm performing a Japanese uh, variety act. So I will use a sushi mat and change it into the many shapes. I will sing a Japanese song. Um, lots of like a uh, fun, family, uh, friendly um, show. Okay. I'm going to do family friendly entertainment. Yeah. It's good to see you. Thank it's you great so to have much. you back in Springfield. Thank, Thank you, you for coming. Thank you. Now we also have lots of acts on the main stage over here. Who are we about to see perform? So this is Uzamaru. They are a Yosakoi dance team from San Jose, California. And uh, we this is the first time they've been here, and we are really excited. They have a real high energy dance performance. Okay, well, yeah. we're going to prove that to you. Brady, if you will point your camera right over here, we're going to watch just a little bit of their performance. Ladies, go for it. My goodness, I wish I had their energy. This is the kind of thing you're going to be able to see all weekend starting at about 5 o'clock tonight. It runs through Sunday. There's food, there's martial arts demonstrations, all sorts of stuff to do out here at the Japanese Stroll Garden. Go to peacethroughpeople.org for a full lineup of activities. Tom, back to you. Joy, this looks great. Absolutely. Thank you very much. Now,